So on this project, we're gonna be working with nature sculptures, fossils. Now this fossil in particular is what we call an ammonite. It was a big spiraling shell. There would have been a lot more to it than just this. And then the creature that lived in it was kind of like a squid. Now this is just a cast of the shell. It's a cast fossil. And originally it would have been uh, a mineral called aragonite that composed the shell. Aragonite weathers away fairly quickly, so that's all gone, but we have this shell here. But what I want to do is I want to cut down the middle of it, and I want to see if any of that shell structure is still intact. I want to polish it all up, make it shine, so we can really see the inside nice and clear, and see if we can make something really cool. Let's give it a try. Always wear your PPE, no matter how stupid it makes you look. So we finished cutting our ammonite. It looks pretty cool inside actually. You can see some of the internal structures and I have some nasty blade marks that I'm gonna have to buff out of there. My saw is not quite big enough to cut through one in one shot, but I got it for 20 bucks on Facebook Marketplace, so it was really cheap. A good rock saw is a lot more than that. So we're gonna take with what we got and see if we can make this into something that looks pretty cool. So I'm back home in the city and it's time to get some of these saw marks out of this thing. Now I know you would say, just use a power sander and buff them right out of there. I live in a studio apartment. I don't have any of that stuff. But what I do have is a file and no life. So here we go. So this one's looking good. Now it's time for the next one. Well, the file took care of most of the saw marks, which is good. It's looking pretty cool inside. Now it's time for the fine grit. Well, that was kind of a fun little project. I think it turned out kind of cool. A little bit of elbow grease, but it got the job done. Let me know if you have any suggestions on how I could have done that better. Write those in the comments below and give me a like and subscribe if you want to come on any more projects. Take care.